One cool thing about the uh, multi-slider is that it actually um, will automatically adjust um, in terms of the number of sliders that you have available depending on uh, the number of elements that you enter into its inlet. So what I mean by that is let's just use a pack object here, the, the pack without the C, right? And we'll enter floating point numbers. By the way, if you want to deal with floating point numbers, you've got to tell pack that you're receiving floating point numbers. So we're going to have two of them right here. And then uh, we'll take the output of the pack and put it in the inlet. Right now, as you know, we only have one slider there, right? But as soon as I add another slider, see, look at that, right? The pack message contains two elements, right? Oh, it's hard to see there, but you can see that the list that's going into the multi-slider actually has two elements in it, right? And so it uh, multi-slider automatically adjusts so that... Um, it gives you two uh, multi-sliders. And as a matter of fact, you can see that in the outlet as well, um, it's sending out two data points as a list.